Dubai, the heart of the United Arab Emirates, the home base of a world-class organization, the Al Habtor Group of Companies. It's a hugely successful business, including car dealerships, leasing operations, hotels and tourism, construction, real estate, and education and publishing. It touches the lives of tens of thousands of people every day. The group's pioneering chairman, Khalaf Al Habtour, is one of a handful of men who turned the small trading post of Dubai into one of the most vibrant and successful metropolises on the planet. He founded his first construction company back in 1970. Since then, the group has rapidly expanded throughout the United Arab Emirates, the Middle East, and Europe. The group has helped to shape the modern image of Dubai and the UAE, including its operations in Beirut and Budapest, the Al Habtor Group provides employment for thousands of people. They are one of the keys to the group's enormous success. The people, the most important. We have highly trained staff. I don't mind whether he's tall or short, black or white. I judge people on their production, and their delivery, and their success. Although Khalaf Al Habtor knows each of his operations in detail, the group is managed by a team of experts who are responsible for the different lines of the business. Some of them, they work with me since very, very long time, from day one. Some of them age between 25 to 30 years. The Al Habtor group has skillfully managed a large number of projects. It helped to build some of the architectural icons of the UAE, the world-famous Burj Al Arab and the Jumeirah Beach Hotel next to it. Large parts of the Jumeirah Beach residence, one of the most exciting seaside developments in the Middle East. In the Dubai Marina, the Al Habtor Business Tower and the residential Al Habtor Tower the Dusit Thani Dubai with its spectacular design. Three hospitals, Rashid Hospital, New Dubai Hospital and Latifa Hospital. And the Al Qasa Hotel in the Madinat Jumeirah. In Abu Dhabi, the Officers Club, the Adnek Building and the Landmark Hotel among others. Examples of the group's expertise include the Terminals 1 and 3 of the Dubai International Airport. Further evidence that the Al Habtor Group is associated with the biggest and best names in the business. Whether it's construction, automotive or hospitality. The Al Habtur Group has been successful for decades dealing with large groups and entities. We deal at eye level with Leighton, Mitsubishi, Starwood and Hilton. The Al Habtur Group has been a driving force in the field of education for more than 20 years. Its two international schools are of the highest standard and prepare its students for some of the very best universities in the world. We are a true international school and we constantly graduate students over the world average. We're not just about academic achievement, we are about character. The Al Habtour Group has led the tourism and hospitality industry of the UAE for the past 30 years. We are pioneer in hotel business in the region over here. We usually don't wait for the competition to happen, we prepare ourselves before. The Habtour Grand Resort and Spa located in the most prestigious beach area of Dubai, is the group's flagship hotel. The renowned Metropolitan Palace is located in Dubai's business district. And soon, the Waldorf Astoria on the Palm Jumeirah will be added to the group's portfolio.
There are the two Hilton-branded hotels in Lebanon, the Hilton Beirut Metropolitan Palace and the Hilton Beirut Habitor Grand, and the group's latest acquisition, its first in Europe, the historic five-star Le Meridian Hotel in the heart of the Hungarian capital, Budapest. It's a step towards further expansion into Europe. Well, we are expanding anyway, but within our area of knowledge. One is expanding on hotels projects within the United Arab Emirates and the West, especially Europe, London, Paris, Munich, Berlin. And there is Al Habtor's highly successful car sales division. Its excellent standards of service and the increasing demand of the UAE's growing population have enabled Al Habtor Motors to grow without interruption. In the market for 30 years, Al Habtor Motors has become one of the top distributors in the country. The secret of the success of Al Habtor Motors, and this is within our culture, we have to make sure that everybody wins within the transaction, starting from the car manufacturer to the end user. We make the client happy, the employee happy, and the manufacturer. We work like partners, and I think this is our success. Bentley cars are offered in showrooms in Dubai and Abu Dhabi. The new McLaren dealership has already broken sales records. Al Habtor Motors also sells one of the most elite supercar brands in the world, the Bugatti. As thousands and thousands turn to Al Habtor Motors for their car purchases, the group's Mitsubishi cars have become bestsellers. Thanks to Al Habtor, the Pajero is the UAE's most successful SUV of all time. For Mitsubishi, we have the number one market share in the world. Its expertise in the automotive field has enabled the group to create one of the largest car rental and leasing companies in the country. The award-winning Diamond Lease caters to individuals and large corporations. In 2011, Al Habtor Motors invested in its 3 million square feet service complex in Dubai Industrial City. It's one of the largest automotive service centers in the world. It comprises a state-of-the-art spare parts distribution center and also serves Habtor's global auto parts, which delivers genuine parts to the billion-dollar market of car parts in the UAE and beyond. We are investing for the future because uh, the whole Emirates is growing and we are growing with the Emirates as well. For the customer, everybody wants customer care, whether you buy a Lancer or whether you buy a Bugatti. Our job is to look after everybody. And our day-to-day -day sales process is always looking at excellence and trying to deliver the maximum for all. And, and that's just the way we work. The Al Habtor Group is currently building a new icon for the Dubai skyline. Our Al Habtor Palace, having three hotels linked together, they're going to be destination for most of the tourists and the residents in Dubai. The Habtor Palace will consist of three luxury hotels run by the Starwood Group. It will be the largest hotel complex in the Middle East, including the region's first permanent Las Vegas-style show for the UAE's growing number of tourists. The Al Habtor Group has grown into one of the most successful businesses in the Middle East. We as Habtor Group, we are 42 years old. We have a positive track record from day one until today. We had a profit all the way in all the companies for the last 42 years. And this is all because the good team we have around us and below us. It will continue to touch the lives and hearts of people here and everywhere. Now, tomorrow, and for decades to come. But the values is there from day one. The honesty and respect and the commitment. You should not breach any agreement, you shouldn't default any arrangement. This is the most important. This is the rule which I set.